Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name's Gary and the UEFA Nations League draw has just completed. England have been drawn in a group alongside Finland, Republic of Ireland and Greece. So what do we think? So as I've said, the draw has finally completed around about an hour ago. And England have got, I think, quite an interesting group. Teams that we haven't usually played that often over recent years. The games for these fixtures will be in September, October and November. And that will be all six match days completed by the 19th of November. So it's a pretty quick turnaround and hopefully England will be promoted back to League A. And I think we, we should obviously be looking at that. There is no one in this group here that England have anything to fear. In terms of FIFA World Rankings, Greece are actually the next best team in this group after England, of course. England are currently third in the FIFA World Rankings and Greece are currently 47th with Finland at 59 and Ireland at 60. So there's a huge gap in quality here just on the FIFA Rankings perspective, but just in general quality overall. Interestingly, the last time England met Finland was in a World Cup qualification campaign in 2002 at Anfield. So a lot has changed since then. It was a 2-1 victory that night. The last time England met Greece was almost 20 years ago as well. It was in 2006 and it was a 4-0 victory for England. At Old Trafford, it's interesting that the last two games we've played Greece were at Old Trafford. Most famously, the game before the 4-0 win in 2002 was the World Cup qualifier. In the same round of fixtures when we last played Finland, if you remember David Beckham scoring that last minute free kick to take through to the World Cup. The 2006 friendly game there was a much easier night for England. Two goals from Peter Crouch, one from John Terry and one from Frank Lampard on the night. England of course did play the Republic of Ireland in a friendly at Wembley in 2020 and it was a 3-0 victory. A comfortable 3-0 victory on the night. Harry Maguire, Jaden Sancho and Dominic Calvert-Lewin were the scorers that night. Only one of these three teams have ever beaten England and that is Ireland. They've beat us twice in 17 appearances against them. England have never lost to Greece or Finland having played Greece nine times winning seven of those and we've played Finland 11 times beating them on nine occasions so this group is should be a formality for England it really should be there is nothing here as I've said for us to fear where England play on what match day is still to be decided I believe it's tomorrow that the Nations League are finalizing those fixtures and I'm absolutely delighted with this I know a lot of the England away faithful didn't want Ireland they wanted a more attractive away fixture but England Island it's special isn't it and I think it'll be a great occasion Greece away and at home will obviously be very interesting as well it was very nearly though Kazakhstan but because of the away travel rules Kazakhstan actually were drawn in England's group but because we had already drawn Ireland earlier in in the draw it meant that we could not draw Kazakhstan so they went to the following group so that is a little bit of a disappointment because I think Kazakhstan would have been a great away fixture. It'd have been a long way to go and very different. But I think England fans can be very excited with this. I think there's some good away fixtures in there mixed in with that home derby, home rivalry, if you like. And I think it's a great Nations League given the fact that we're in League B and we haven't got those big nights at Wembley to look forward to anymore. If you look at England's last group, Germany, Italy, there were some really exciting nights there, but they have now been replaced with some international derbies and some different away fixtures so overall I am very pleased with this from an England perspective and England should absolutely walk this group and it's tough actually to see which one of these three teams will be a challenge for England I don't perceive any to be a challenge for England but which one is arguably the better team out of Finland Republic of Ireland and Greece I'm not so sure I'm really not I'm open to suggestions on this one as I've said in terms of FIFA rankings Greece are the best team in this group after England but I don't think there's going to be much in it between the three of them. Helsinki, Dublin and Athens. Here we come and here we come. League A of the Nations League. I am so confident England will top this group. England will top this group with six victories in total and a hat full of goals. I promise you that. Thank you all for watching this video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Really different games for England. Thank you all for watching and I will see you all on my next video.